St. Lawrence Brothers of Bay City, Michigan has been selling peanuts and candies for over 100 years. Established in 1904, the store has a very rich history to go along with many confections. Originally located on 1st and Water, the business was moved in 1917 to 3rd and Water, where it currently stands today. Mart St. Lawrence shares with us some of her memories of the earliest days of St. Lawrence Brothers. The owners were my husband's father and his father's brother, Joe. My husband's grandparents came from Quebec City, Canada. Somebody told them to come to Detroit. They could find a lot of work and they moved to Detroit and then they told them to come to Bay City. There was a lot of money to be made with lumber. I guess that didn't appeal to them. When they started the company, my husband's father and his brother were selling peanuts in a little plastic bag, little five cents peanuts. What inspired the family? They had an idea and, and then it grew and grew and uh, we celebrated 100 years in 2004 when they started to make peanut butter. That was one of the main items they sold. At that time also, they used to have ice cream and they did away with the ice cream selling at one point. And then they started to make chocolate and different types of chocolate with nuts. They make a lot of um, candies at this point and they, they keep making peanut butter. When I first came here, uh, I thought it was a very, very interesting store to see. I mean, all the different types of uh, nuts they had. And on the second floor, they, they made the peanut butter. This was very, very interesting to uh, see them working, you know, making peanut butter. We had real, real good employees, you know, they were real nice. My kids work uh, part-time uh, after school and they were old enough. None of the St. Lawrence wanted to take over the business afterwards, so it was sold to Steve, Fry, and Keith. Keith Whitney is one of the current co-owners of St. Lawrence Brothers. The building was built about 1850, and it used to be a lumberjack town, and so it used to be seven liquor establishments, and then there was a house of ill repute on the fourth floor. Actually, the guy who Paul Bunny was based on was killed in this building. He got in a fight in here and rolled out on the street, and somebody killed him out on the street. We roast all the nuts here, and then we chalk cover some of the nuts, like peanut clusters, cashew clusters, uh, coconut clusters, pecan clusters, that, 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 those kind of things. We've always had old-fashioned candy. We try to get the old kind when, when our generation was young, so when we see it, and we bring it out, and it's popular. Now we see all ages, from young kids to teenagers to young adults to older people. So we have a wide variety of customers. A lot of people who move away, that when they come back to Bay City, they have to stop here and get candy, or they go away for the winters, and they, they have a ship candy or nuts to them. St. Lawrence Brothers has been a prominent business in the Bay City community since its establishment in 1904 by the St. Lawrence family. The business has been open for over 100 years and has a wealth of history to prove it. Through all of the ups and downs of life, St. Lawrence Brothers is still a popular stop for nuts and candy for all.